A lot of car manufacturers are starting to design cars with peak power, turbochargers, and no longer naturally aspirated. This is different. Hello everyone, welcome to Liverable. This is the new Mazda MX-5. And let's start with, oh, <laughs> let's start with what's under the hood. Looks pretty, eh? The design of this car, I've seen a lot of people going and like, oh no, it's not a good looking car. It doesn't look nice at all. The proportions is all out. Nonsense. I think this car looks fantastic. Right. This is Mazda's two liter. 16 valve twin cam engine sky active engine which means the compression ratio is way above the 14 mark it's a lovely little engine 118 kilowatt and 200 newton meters of torque before that number puts you off understand this car only weighs 1057 kilograms this is the rf model so what happens here is the softer version is actually over 50 kilograms lighter than this RF version. This engine in this specific car is mated to a six-speed automatic gearbox, which Mazda claims is fast to downshift and also fast to upshift. Let me take you along the side. Check this design out over here. I love this small little crease in this headlight and the little diffusers here at the bottom. They look so nice. Stunning 17 inch wheels with 205, 45, 17 Bridgestone Potenzas in them, on them. And like I said before, this is the RF model. So we have a metal folding roof. Let me actually put it up for you and show you how that works. Right, so this is the top coming up now. Fast. Without knock my head. And everything's locked and unlocked just by the push of the button. You have to do nothing here on top. It's quite deep. And my, ja oh, my brother and my jackets are in here. You can see it's really deep and it's quite a big opening. So you can get some shopping in here. There's even a little, little pouch that um, Mazda gives you. Obviously with the first aid kit and whatnot. That's quite nice. Interior wise, very nice. Seating position is bang, bang on. We'll talk more about it when we're driving the car. You have these three screens in front of you on the left hand side there's information here's a, something i don't like about this car the screen over here can't show what music is playing and i'd actually like it to show what music i'm playing because a lot of the time i have this screen over here on my fuel efficiency and fuel economy uh, information so all navigation so I, I i hope that in the future there's an update to make that to see to, to show you what music is playing over there we have a bow sound system if you look at the little logo over here there's two speakers in the headrest, so when you're sitting, they're playing in stereo around your ear. So it creates this ambient, almost sort of, like you're in this cocoon of audio. It's a stunning sounding sound system. Flappy pedals behind the steering wheel. And a beautiful three-spoke leather wrap wheel as well. In the center, we have our climate control switches. So fan speed, temperature, and where the air must go. We have heated seats in the middle as well. A place to put your phone another place to put some stuff more storage over here in the center if i climb out then more storage behind this seat over here as well if i pull this cover out over here you have a secret compartment over there which is quite nice <laughs> Let me take you guys for a spin in the Mazda Miata. I actually want to show you guys the dynamics and I also want to show you guys what the car's like with the dash on off here on this little slippery straight we have. So to set your Mazda MX-5 up, we're going to go into 
the sport mode so drive right we're going to put it into manual so i can use the flappy pedals this is the automatic version of this car and that's what we're going to talk about as well during this course i'm putting into sport mode you just push that toggle up and it puts you into sport is there anyone coming on no trash control button is over here so if i push that button over there i can now turn the trash control off so let's turn out of this bend and just show you guys what this is like you guys see that it's, it's it's not bad but you can get the back in quite a bit out if you're not careful with the score so let's do first gear again not bad at all not bad at all touch your control back on because obviously it's quite a bit of a damp road today and we don't want to get into too much trouble the big thing i want to talk about to the car is its throttle response the throttle is so peppy and just so fast to the touch because of the naturally aspirated high compression engine and the engine pulls quite strong all the way to red line i must say i'm quite impressed with that but just the way the steering feels i can tell what color paint is on the road here ladies and gentlemen i can tell right that is white this is yellow through the steering wheel the communication with this car through the bends is unbelievable I, there is a bit of um wetness in the road so we have to always just slack for that let's lock it down to second gear i mean <laughs> i can just feel exactly how much grip is on the front wheels I can feel everything through the steering wheel. It's the steering wheel is <laughs> it's the best I felt in a car so far. It's a bit of a dip here. And the engine sounds quite perky as well. so good like i can use all this car's power and i don't have to be afraid of it biting me in the ass or at um at doing weird things in corners and then if i want to calm down just back into drive put the car into normal mode and there we go oh piece of plastic in the road and now i can relax and i'm not gonna lie i really like this automatic people were like oh no my miata must be a manual and, uh, and everyone's getting on with me yeah but it must be a manual no man it's just as good as a bloody automatic i don't understand what people is complaining about yeah okay maybe drive involvement will be better in oh let's see if we can get in front of the toyota and we're still doing speed limit fantastic little car <laughs> so yeah if i try and float over the line it's going to did you see that give me a warning as well so a lot of the nice safety features on it but it doesn't like tug the steering thing it just beeps to warn you that hey you're going across the line now we can talk about the wind noise quickly you can hear but a wind noise coming in here i personally don't find it too obtrusive all i'll do is turn up the stunning bose sound system Oh, I like have tingles at the back of my neck. <laughs> the sound system is so good. Yeah, and like it doesn't like shout at you. It's just bass and warm mids and sweet treble and oh, it's so nice. Yo, definitely one of the nicer roads. The sound system I've heard in a while in a car. And I mean we're cruising on the straight. 120 at 2100 rpm oh this is a machine this little car <laughs> now you're probably wondering but old miatas were, were like fabulous to turbocharge and things like that this car's a little bit more tricky what you do is you find yourself a 
biggest turbocharger you can you put it on here because there's so much compression in this engine it's gonna spin that turbo really fast and then you boost at 0.5 or 0.6 bar boost and you should be fine you'll probably make about say 130 140 kilowatt but yeah it's not that easy to turbocharge these motors because of that crazy compression ratio so the Mazda MX-5 what do I think of it what, what's my conclusion to this car I really like it at 560,000 Rand or just over 550,000 Rand it is a lot to ask but it is a lot of car don't worry about the performance the 118 kilowatt is not gonna let you down the car's nippy agile on its feet and the back end that's so quick to to play with you know and on that limit you can really dance and put the car where you want it on the road it's a very nice car and a very easy car to handle thank you so much to ikram from premium express car wash for keeping this car nice and clean for me this week i really appreciate it and check out liberable merchandise in the description box below thank you so much to Mazda south africa i really appreciate you guys sending me out the mx5 to use for the week and film for the liberable audience it is a honor don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, share with friends and family. Be free, be you. Love a rebel. Out.